done. So ignore my hair and everything, but I'm unboxing this really fun package because I'm gonna make tie-dye sweatpants, like a sweatsuit because I've been wanting one for forever. And I was looking everywhere and I couldn't find any that were like under $80. So I'm gonna make my own because I haven't DIY'd in so long. So I got mine from Pretty Little Thing and shout out to their shipping. It was in England on April 1st and it's now April 3rd and it's in my room. So hope everyone is doing well. I'm gonna wash my hands after I open this because we are in quarantine or just like social distancing. Okay, so here's how it looks. Ooh, okay, so these are the sweatpants, they're soft. Are they gonna be long enough? Yeah, I need to try these on. Oh, they don't have pockets. Oh, all right. Well, and then I got a sweatshirt. Oh, it's like an oversized sweatshirt. Okay. Hmm. All right. Here's how we're looking. Okay, so here's the before. Hello everyone, so I have washed everything and now I'm gonna start tie-dyeing. I'm gonna go outside and actually tie-dye, but I think for like the scrunching part or whatever, I'm here in the kitchen. Okay, back to what I was doing. My chemistry, my orgo class opened, so I got that. Hopefully I passed chemistry this semester to get into orgo. But yes, um, I got the professor I was wanting in the class I was wanting, so I had to like run and do that. But yes, for now, I'm gonna just scrunch this and hopefully it turns out good. And then I'm gonna use the rubber bands to secure it. And I have my AirPods in because I thought someone was going to call me back, someone from my school. Okay, so we had a quick lunch break, but now I am back. Like I said, excuse my hair, it just looks a mess. But okay, so I have some socks that I think I'm gonna tie dye. The shirt, the pants, I'm kinda worried about cause I don't know if I did this right, but it's fine, it's fine. It'll be fine. Cause this is my first time doing the scrunch method. So here's my tie dyeing stuff. Let's see, actually. Okay, so I have everything set up, my dye and everything to tie dye these. Hopefully it turns out good and it's so nice outside. I'm gonna let it sit for a day. So here's the socks. Do we? Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Okay, these are the sweatpants. Isn't that cool? Look at that. Okay. And we'll just rinse these. Okay, here's the top, the sweatshirt. Here we go. And this is 
tell the sweatshirt. Oh, that does look cool though. Voila. Even though it has like more white. When I wash it, it'll. Boy. That's cool. Wow. Okay. Snapped. Yes. Now we're gonna rinse these and wash them. Say goodbye, Dolly. <laughs> Say bye, darling. <laughs> okay, so here is the final product of the tie-dye sweatsuit. We have a special guest. Say hello. A special guest. A special guest. She doesn't want to be seen. Okay. But here's the top. So I think because the top is like half cotton or whatever, it like took the color a lot better. I'm still wearing my clothes underneath here. And then the sweatpants, they're more like polyester. So it's more of like a pastel. But I really like how this looked and I was actually thinking about doing this in the beginning like just like a pastel blue so they kind of don't match but like it's whatever and then the socks also turned out really good too so yes here's my fit here is how it looks the final product i hope you all enjoyed this video have a great day or night and i'll talk to y'all later bye